Hi boys and girls. We're going to read you a story today about ladybugs. It's called, It's a Good Thing There Are Ladybugs. And I agree, I love ladybugs. How do you feel about ladybugs, Tino? Good, you like them? Okay. Here's my table of contents. Here's my heading and the photograph. Did you want to read this page? Can you read it? Okay. Many people like ladybugs because they are pretty. Some people even think they bring good luck. But ladybugs are more than just lucky. It's a good thing there are ladybugs. Ladybugs are good friends to farmers and gardeners. That is because ladybugs eat harmful insects called aphids. Without ladybugs, aphids would kill a lot of plants. Down here, there's a fun fact. During its lifetime, a ladybug may eat up to 5,000 aphids. Here's a picture. Ladybugs are food for other animals, such as frogs, wasps, spiders, and dragonflies. <laughs> This unlucky ladybug got caught in a spider's web. Tiny insects. A ladybug is an insect that is part of the beetle family. Like other insects, ladybugs have six legs. They have two sets of wings and two antenna. Their bodies have three parts, head, thorax, and abdomen head, thorax, and abdomen. And what's that one between the thorax and abdomen? Oh. Where? Oh, I, I oh. thought I saw it. Oh, antenna. Antenna, yep. So there's the antenna and then the legs. So those are the different body parts of a ladybug. All ladybugs are less than a quarter inch long. They have round or oval bodies. Ladybugs can have red, orange, yellow, pink, black, or brown shells. Their shells may have spots, stripes, or no markings at all. Okay. Done. Harlequin. The Harlequin ladybugs, 22 spotted ladybug, two point ladybug, yellow sh shorted. Shouldered. Shouldered ladybug. <laughs> I almost called it a yady bug. <laughs> <laughs> wow, those are cool. They're so the one, interesting. The one at the bottom and all the way this way, this guy, mm -hmm. it almost looks like a potato. <laughs> yeah, I see what you mean. Ladybugs, this is a fun fact, ladybugs are also known as ladybird beetles and lady beetles. I knew the lady beetle part, but not ladybird beetles. I know, interesting, right? Would you like to read this one? Okay. Read the heading first. Staying safe. Ladybugs have several ways of protecting themselves. The insect's hard front wings, called the eltria, Elytra. Elytra protects its body from other insects and small predators. Oh, okay. <clears throat> so the two hard wings that are on the outer shell of the ladybug are called elytra. <laughs> it helps protect them. Ladybugs can also give off a nasty liquid from their legs. Any animal that tries to eat the ladybug will find that it tastes terrible. The bright markings on the ladybug's shell are for more than decoration. They warn enemies that ladybugs taste bad. I, sometimes, and for me, most of the time, it means poisonous. What means poisonous? Like, 
bright colors. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You're right. A lot of times in nature, things are bright colors because they're poisonous. The most common ladybug in North America is the seven-spotted ladybug, which has a shiny red and black body. That's probably the one that most of us have seen before. I see the one that, I see this kind, just like the black and red one. Mm -hmm. Yep, that's the seven-spotted ladybug. Oh. If an animal attacks the ladybug, it might play dead. It lies very still until the predator goes away. The ladybug stays very still until it feels safe. Wow. So we just learned three different ways that ladybugs <clears throat> can protect themselves. A ladybug's life. <clears throat> Ladybugs lay eggs on the bottom side of leaves in a garden. The young ladybugs hatch in a few days. They are called larvae. The larvae are very hungry and start eating aphids right away. And I think they eat their shells too. The shell of the egg? Yeah. Did you learn that caterpillars do that? Oh yeah, maybe I'm getting mixed up with the caterpillars. No, maybe ladybugs do it too. I'm not sure. Here's some eggs, the larva. And this fun fact says, a female ladybug can lay as many as 2,000 eggs in her lifetime. That's crazy. Mm -hmm. The larva grow quickly. They shed their skin several times before reaching full size. The larva then becomes a pupa. Inside the pupa case, an amazing change is taking place. After two weeks, an adult ladybug comes out. This shows a ladybug pupa on a leaf. Ladybugs hibernate or sleep in winter. When spring comes, it's time for the ladybugs to wake up and start eating aphids again. Fun fact, a hibernating group of ladybugs may contain in thousands of insects. Wow. Does that mean it eats thousands of insects? Or just no, just when they're hibernating, yeah. that a group of ladybugs that are hibernating together, there may be thousands of them at a time in one place. Oh, I th like you said, insects, then, like, then it makes me think like different insects. <laughs> yeah, no, just that the ladybugs are insects. Mm -hmm. After they awake, these gardeners' friends get right to work helping people again. It's a good thing there are ladybugs. I think it's the end. Over here it says, ladybugs are good for, and then it shows some pictures. It says, protecting plants from harmful insects, providing food for animals such as spiders, adding beauty to the garden, because they're so beautiful to see and to look at. Here's some creature feature fun. Creature feature, that rhymes. As ladybugs age, the color of their spots begins to fade. That's interesting. Ladybugs breathe through openings found on the sides of their bodies. A ladybug can pull its head back into its body. I thought only turtles and tortoises do that. <laughs> Most ladybugs are helpful, but some, including the Mexican bean beetle and the squash beetle, do eat plants. Here's some riddles. What's the only insect that is not allowed in the boys' bathroom? A ladybug. <laughs> what is the only thing smaller than a ladybug's mouth? A ladybug's dinner? I don't get it. Because your food has to be smaller than your mouth so it can fit inside. Oh, of it. I get it. Yep. Okay, that's it, boys and girls. I hope you enjoyed our read aloud of It's a Good Thing There Are Ladybugs. Bye, Bye. first graders.